Inside Auburn's backcountry store, you'll find a treasure trove of rocks, minerals, and gems of every shape, size, and sort. Some valuable, others not. I'm rock poor. If I could sell every rock in here, I could retire him probably. But it's been rock bottom for David Holtzinger after thieves broke into his store three times this month alone. Basically, they're probably going for gold and silver and don't have much of either but that's easy to melt down and move. All these were initially taken, but later left behind. However, the thieves still got away with several hundred dollars worth of items. The first two times the thieves broke in, they actually took out this door and part of the wall. You can see this is what's left of the frame. There's even these metal bolts still in it. The third time they got even bolder and broke right through the wall. A wall he since patched up. That's the first time I've ever heard of somebody actually going through a brick wall. Auburn police investigators don't have any leads on the tunneling thieves, but wouldn't be surprised if the items turned up in a pawn shop. If they're going after something valuable or something they know they can, once they steal it, they can get rid of it and get money for it, that's something that could also be considered. After three break-ins, Holtzinger is preparing for a fourth. The more they do it, the more I say I'm not going to give up and I'm going to get them. I'll get the last laugh, let's put it that way. After closing, he's now taking some of the most expensive items home, unwilling to risk another rock robbery. In Auburn, Tom Miller, KCRA 3 News.